Now here's how you can install Notion on your MacBook, let it be MacBook Air or MacBook Pro. It's not really that big of a deal. Obviously you can use Notion on your web browser. Like you can literally just log in through this like website, but it is naturally much better to just get the specific app, right? So there are some options on how you can get there. Um, obviously the first choice might be to check out the app store, which is for the apps on your computer but notion doesn't really have any app in there because when you look up the word notion on your uh, app store within the macbook it's only going to give you the ability to get the notion web clipper which is useful but it's a separate application in order to install notion on your actual computer make sure to type in notion download into your web browser like this and you're going to be directed to the Apple, I mean, the Notion's website, and you can see Notion for a Mac and Windows, so you're going to click on that, and essentially you want to download the Notion installer file, but make sure you pick the correct one, obviously there is one for Windows as well. So as you can see right here, we can download it for Mac OS. So there's like one button in here, but when you scroll down a bit, you can see that you get to pick the specific version because obviously now you have Windows, you have Intel based Macs, you have the Mac OS silicon and you have, you've got the universal, right? So if you just pick this one, this is going to be the universal one, but you want to choose this specific. Obviously it's a better idea to get the one which you have. Now this is a MacBook with a Intel chip. When I check out at this, Mac information, you can see that it's got an Intel Iris Plus graphics, right? It's a little bit older Mac, but I can still get these specific version for Intel based Macs. So when you click on this, you want to make sure you download this one. Obviously, as I said, is the correct one for your instance. On the M1 chips, you choose Apple Silicon. But then you check out your folder, you go to your downloads section, and you're going to notice that there is a notion.dmg file. So that is the installer. So you have to just double click it and just go through the process of installing the app, right? So it has to load up. As I say, this computer is a little bit, oh, a little bit, perhaps it's taken a bit longer. Now, this is what's going to pop up when you open up this like download link and you want to just drag this notion icon into your applications like that so this is the official installer and right now i'm pretty sure that this is it we've got notion right here which can be added to your dock and you can just open it up and start using it the proper way obviously you're gonna have to log in and everything but that is all about the installing process so hope you found this video helpful make sure to hit the thumbs up if you liked it subscribe for more and i'm gonna see you later on in the next video